medium voltage monitoring project was about getting familiar with medium voltage assets and finding a way to interface current and voltage, basically to perform our condition monitoring uh, in the same way we're also used to for low voltage machines. Now starting the project, the first things we needed to understand is how do these medium voltage machines look like? I mean, are they uh, somewhat similar to low voltage? Do they have a motor control cabinet as we are used to for low voltage machines? So all kinds of questions that were either technical or operational and just getting a feel for what it's all about. So it turned out that in these medium voltage machines there are current transformers and voltage transformers readily available. First assessment was to check the performance of these uh, types of transformers, do bandwidth measurements, do sensitivity measurements, then really get the picture clear, are these instruments suitable for condition monitoring? We actually bought a couple of current transformers just to get an idea of how well they transmit the signals that we are interested in. So for example, we did a bandwidth test in which we basically did a frequency sweep of these current transformers and then measure the output uh, with our measurement system. The outcome of that was very positive. I was actually very surprised how well uh, these uh, big transformers transmit these small and high frequency signals. We started a pilot project with Nurion, uh, one of our customers, where we uh, were monitoring eight medium voltage pumps. And the goal of this pilot to, was to uh, validate that our installation concept actually worked in practice and uh, to gather uh, practical data of those machines and do the same bandwidth and sensitivity analysis that we did at our workbench. So in a fairly early stage of these pilots, it already turned out that we could see uh, developing failure modes. As the pilot was running, we got more and more data and uh, this data turned out to be of uh, sufficient quality, actually very comparable to what we're used to for uh, low voltage machines, so uh, further increasing our confidence in the solution. Uh, for me as a hardware architect, it was very exciting to find a match between these medium voltage assets and our equipment and um, then deliver the service to the customers that they value also for our low voltage solution.